Hey, hey, hey guys, Old Man G here back again with another video for Red Devil Studio. Van der Beek to leave Manchester United. That is the, coming from the Metro, who I think are quoting the mirror. We're going to get into it. But if you need to channel to like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio, follow us on Twitter United X and smash that notification button for the latest Manchester United news. So Van der Beek to leave Manchester United. That's the reports. Obviously, this is the Metro here. Um, according to Metro, quoting the star. Now, you know, the star is garbage. The star is garbage, um, you know. So, to be honest, I'm already taking this um, news with probably a pinch of salt. Um, but according to the star, um, the Netherlands star is looking to leave Manchester United. Um, he's only obviously started two games in the Premier League and only 11 matches across all competitions, which, to be fair, is bad. It is actually very, very bad. And Oli should be using it more. Um, you know, we should see more Van der Beek. I don't really see how he's... Even Matic is ahead of him because I don't think Matic had a good season full stop. Um, but it is what it is. Um, the poor also claims that the lack, his lack of playing time has harmed his chance of winning a place in Netherlands squad for the European uh, Championship campaign. And that's, I guess, a fair point. And his claim that Van der Beek will speak with United's executive chairman Edward before the season's finished to determine his next move and why he's been overlooked by Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. The United Manager's over his patient after he was given little penalties in the season, but the midfielder was used only sparingly. And then Solskjaer admitted in January, I wouldn't say that Donny is happy. So while I don't necessarily trust the star, it is reasonable to expect that Donny Van Beek is probably not happy. As he wouldn't be with without playing time. It's the same thing when Pogba came out, I think, before the Europa game and said and said wanting to leave. You know, he was being benched, you know, so. You know, Pogba and Van der Beek at times are clearly sure they've not been happy because they've not been in the starting squad. You don't hear from Freddie McTominay being unhappy because they've been played regularly. Um, and in fairness, as much as I have an issue with McFred at times, they've been fit most of the time. Has Fred even been injured this season? You know, well, people don't like Fred, but the reality is that he's our fittest midfielder, or arguably with Bruno. They're not. He's not injured. They're not injured. You know, so you've got to you've got to bear that in mind. But um, I do hope that Van der Beek um, does story. Van der Beek looks like he's going to be back as well, um, back um, uh, for the AC Milan game. So we'll see how the story unfolds. Um, but I would take the day star with a pinch of salt. I don't think um, that it's that credible, to be honest. But it is obvious that Van der Beek um, is is um, you know isn't happy. And you know he's have to be, he has to wait for his opportunity, and I think the opportunity will more so come next season when you see the likes of Matic and Mata probably leave the club. I don't think the club is going to go for a midfielder this summer, and so I think that that probably paves the way, especially if Pog believes for Van der Beek to come to the side. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think. Do you think Van der Beek will leave? Should Oli have used him more? What are your thoughts? Remember to comment, like, subscribe below. Have a nice day, guys, and cheers.